Hello everyone, this is Yamin and in this tutorial I am going to show you how you can add a font or some icon in a button. So here you can see a icon, this is coming from the font or some and this is just a button uh, that design comes from the bootstrap. So let me just show you. Over here I have a button over here and here you can see BTN BTN primary. This is a bootstrap class and here you can see the download text over here. So right now if I now save it and here you can see I have a download button over here and we need to add a icon onto some icon over here before the download. So for it what we need to do is that we need to go to this link onto some.com. So I will give this link in the description so that you can just directly come over here and here you can see a lot of icon. For example I want to get this icon so I will just click on it then it will show me something like this. If I now just click on it here you can see HTML React View SVG. You can choose any option that you want. So I'll choose the H table. Here you can see icon. So if I now just click on it, it will get copied. So let's go back. And here what you need to do is that after this, we are going to paste it. We, if we now just paste it over here, the icon, here you can see, uh, if we just paste it like this, after the button, we will have the icon and here you can see the download text. So right now, if we say, then if we now refresh the icon on show over here because we use the font awesome icon but we did not use the font awesome serial link over here in the head section so for it what we need to do is that we need to search over here font awesome serial link just press enter and here you can see cd njs.com so you can just go inside it and from here you can just copy the serial link from here if you now just click on it there you can see it got copied and right now let's go back and we need to paste it in the head section and one more thing uh, that you should do is that whenever you are getting the font browser cd link make sure that you always get the latest version okay so right now save then if you now go back there you can see the icon is over here Let's go and get one more icon from here. Uh, let's get close icon. Let me just search over here close. And uh, here you can see a close. Let me just click on it. Let me copy this. Let's go back to our code editor. Let me just do this. Let me go down. And here I'm going to make another button. So let me just show here button. Then in this button we're going to say close and for this button let's mention a class it will be btn btn danger if we now save there you can see we have a close button so for it if we need to add an icon we just paste the icon that we just copied from here we we'll paste it over here and if we now save it there you can see we have a close icon over here so this is how you can add font or some icon in a button i hope this tutorial is useful to you so leave a comment if you want and make sure to subscribe. I really appreciate that and I hope to see you in the future tutorials.